welcome back guys all right I'm gonna get on the water this morning probably about nine o'clock right now bluebird sky but we got wind so hopefully the wind plays a factor all right just gotta throw it out there I came out here yesterday didn't film and uh, I had an awesome day on crappie actually it was really really good but had a little mishap with my basket uh, I probably had about 15 to 20 crappie good sized ones too but when I decided to, to put up and get the boat out of the water pulled up my basket there was only five crappie in there so uh, yeah I had to I don't know where it came out but uh, I went ahead and tied a little you know, you really can't see it tied me a little wire right there and I got this little hook I'm gonna see maybe I can hook the basket I don't know if it came out of the top or the front or in the bottom but uh they all swam out of there that basket was full guys I mean it was full but uh I'm gonna see if I can replicate yesterday today everything is different yesterday there was hardly any wind like four miles per hour cloudy today is total opposite windy in a bluebird sky but I figured out a little technique these crappie were on the very very bottom and I'm gonna go with it today again to see if that's what they want that's what they hit I had my long pole and then a regular pole and basically I just let it hit the bottom one or two cranks up and just let the poles just sit right there on my lap and I mean it was BAM one after another I mean that's how I was catching them off the bottom not doing nothing the steel the more steel that the the jig was the, the, the more bites I was getting so all right gonna do it see if we can catch some so stay tuned sit back let's see if we can get we get some in the boat guys this is kind of the setup I have see it Poe just sitting there like this sitting across and just got a tick right here on this one you see my pole move I don't know if this wind is gonna play a factor today but it's like when you get closer to the edge of the grass line there's a secondary weed line and then from the secondary weed line it breaks into either a hard bottom or a mud bottom and uh, honestly that's usually where they're where they're at so uh, with the wind it's a little bit more today I think it was easier when it was still all right guys got my two poles out here hoping to get a bite this wind just has me just going every which way it's nothing identical to what I was dealing with yesterday I've got my first first one. Oh wow well not a crappie it caught a bass good one Kind of hard to hide it with this long pole right here. He's a good little solid chunk chunker there. If I can bring him in. There he is. And he hit like a crappie. Just a bass, just a little bass. It's not what I'm looking for. It's a catch. Oh, shoot, there's my first one. I gotta remember where I caught this one. Ah. I'm gonna get off this spot. Oh 
got a bionics fishing just showed up his first cast and I've been struggling out here he catches him a nice crappie what did you th what were you chunking All right, I'm gonna change mine. It's super sunny right now, so I'm sure they can get a mile away. I'm gonna switch colors. I got everything on deck right now. Yeah, finally. He's little, isn't he? Big keeper. Oh yeah, I got a little thing right here. Oh yeah, he's like the water is feeding into there. Two inches. What do you think? Do what now? They're on the bottom, man. Well, keep on trying it. Huh? Keep on trying it. I just left that one alone, you know, really. I just need the wind to cooperate with me just a little bit. There's another one. You just do it and left it alone? You gotta, yeah. This one feels a little bit stouter. What size weight you got on? Eighth. Oh, this is a, this is a tank. Eighth, eighth time. I told you they're over here. Oh. That's a tank, bro. That's a tank, bro. That's a tank. Look at that. That's a tank. That's meaty. Ah. That's some nice fillets right there, guys. Yeah, he's about to get this point of the I was about to put up, take off. Yeah, don't do it. Don't do it yet. Oh. All right, we're gonna try it again. I should have casted it out while I was messing with the basket. Yeah. How I had another one? Huh? How I had another one on the bottom? Yeah. What about that eight? Yeah. Got another one already. Yeah, that's bad. Telling me, man. Another tank. Another tank. Man, every time I'm gonna have to put him down and I'll cast this back out. I wonder if this one will make the cut. You're all tangled up, huh? Well, that's how I felt earlier. Dang, I got one that didn't make the cut. Yeah, it did. Barely. I got just hooked up on the tank. Woo, nice one. On the bottom, huh? That bass that I saw a while ago. Yeah. I saw him swimming right there. Didn't you heard me right? It's like, dude, I just see a bass come up over here. Little, little one. All right, guys. Well, the day is getting a little bit better, but it's nothing, nothing like yesterday. The technique. Yesterday, I, I mean, like I have this one 
pole just hanging off the bottom. I was just catching them left and right like that. Today, you actually have to give them a presentation. There he is. Yeah, this is a crappie. Yeah, this is a crappie. No, it's a, it's a big old gill, bro. He just. <laughs> he swallowed it. Oh, it's pissing all over me. Huh? Check it out, guys. Huh? That's a, that's a bonus catch. Dude, this, what kind of bluegill is this? If viewers know, y'all let me know. This is, it's got red on it, on the red ear. Is that what it is? Yeah, I don't know. It's it's a cool one. Grass jumping. He got me in the grass. Ooh, I'm about to lose this one. Oh man! Get it for you guys. I don't know if he's gonna make it. Well, he's as long as the thing. It's ten inches. Oh guys, that bass is getting full. Gonna get another bite right here. Nope. Yep, right here. Another one. Right here underneath me, long poling. Another tank. Ah. Yeah. Right back out. Oh, that one. That one go. That's just getting full, guys. It's getting full. Oh, another one. As soon as I hook up on one or put one in the basket, he ain't gonna make the cut. I must be right on top of them, guys. I must be right on top of them. He's going back in. Pause it. It's finding that right depth. I actually think they were out here to my right a little bit. It's when the wind pulls me back that way. It's when they hit. I'm just going to have to pay attention to my long pole a little bit more. Alright guys, I'm on the phone with my bro and got a nice one. Woo, it's a tank. Yeah. We're going to have some fillets. Some sacolets. Heck yeah. Alright bro, I'll holler at you. Alright, alright. Basket. All right, guys. So we went ahead and called it. It just got too windy. Gave up. Check it out, guys. Yeah, that's Eggers. That's Eggers' stringer right there. He bonics fish now. He uh, he battled the wind today. And over here, I got a little basket that I got off the water. But still, I got about about a dozen maybe. All in all, together, I know we got over 20. 10, 11, 12. How many got that 20? Looks like you got 18, maybe 19. Almost limit, almost, almost got a limit, bro. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we could have had a limit. Yeah, but the wind, bro. Check out the, the lake. That wind is just brutal. <laughs> That's it. Hope y'all like it. I know it was short but sweet. Uh, anyways, give us a like, thumbs up. Maybe next time we come out, <coughs> it won't be so windy. But uh, anyways, thanks for viewing, guys. We'll catch you on the next one.